sometimes you are more exhausted probably than you remember you were when you had not a family. Uh, but sometimes at the same time you, you, you think, okay, you had moments where you were exhausted also before. But uh, weeks at home, you know you, you should have been resting more, you, you should maybe be sleeping a little bit more for, for combining it with being a top athlete. But I, I think now after so many years you are convinced that that gives you, it's balanced with the, the energy you get out of having a family around you and the fun also that gives you that in the total I think I would probably have less top results without the family. So. I got the, all the good benefit out of it, and uh, I'm, I, I feel proud and privileged that I will not retire. I go a different way after this season, and I have a boy that remembers the mommy as a cyclist. Because there are a lot of uh, athletes that continue for one or two seasons, but the kids don't remember anything of it. Uh, he will meet a lot of people during the next 30 years, they would say, ah, oh, you are the son of Kinrita. And yeah, I've been out there. I've uh, shared my mommy on and I've been a part of it. And he remember everything. So that's uh, something special. Also, when I remember back when I was young, I always liked to, to do something and go for it 100% and, and get that feeling that you get tired, you get exhausted, and also the, the good feeling after when you can relax and think back, oh, it actually felt good. Of course, there are two different kind of suffering when you are in super shape. It doesn't suffer that much. Are you in bad shape, having a bad day? It's awful. Then you sometimes think, oh, why am I doing this? So there is two kind of pain in a way. Uh, but if you have been up there and you have these races flying like an eagle, whatever you call it, you want to be there again. And that's enough to also handle these bad days, I think. It's a, it's a new world also. Just thinking about the young one coming up, you can find everything you are searching on the internet. At that time, you, you found something in a shop and okay, this is something maybe I should test out. And uh, most of the time, whatever you tested, you had such a bad stomach after racing and during the race that the, you thought, okay, I ate something, maybe I pushed too hard, but you knew, knew in your mind that it was what you have been putting into yourself. I think today, um, the, the, like, like, like Windforce, it's, you know it is uh, scientific, it's, it's really, really something that your body can absorb. Uh, in a fast way, in a good way, and you don't have to suffer for half a day after with stomach pain. So it's a new world. And, and you know it's also the quality is something that f uh, the body can handle. Uh, and a lot of the stuff now, now we have on the market is even better than the food you buy in the shop. So uh, it's a new world for sure. I really fell in love in the night protein. I should eat it and take it in the night, but sometimes I knew I have a busy day uh, after training that I know I won't get, be able to eat. So having it also sometimes in the afternoon, yeah, night protein, yeah, I also use it during the day. So uh, that's uh, one of my favorite, but um, I call it the, the gel or the bars that you have in the pocket when you ride, it's super good. The coconut uh, taste, that's the favorite. Um, it's something that you really can feel the body has get energy out of, and that's important. And you never have problem with the stomach. I don't want to mention any kind of name for product from older days. My God, how could we even eat it? It's not, yeah, it's now we are laughing about it.